I'm Rob Dexter, and I am the singer and bass player from the hard rock band based out of Orlando, Florida, called Kings County, and I'm here to talk about our new single coming out. It's called Seven Reasons. The original meaning behind the song when we first wrote it was it's based on relationships and relationships that go bad over time. Um, anytime we write an original, we always try to write from real situations, whether maybe one of the guys in the band had been through or myself. And I think that's important to connect to the listener. When you write about real things, people tend to gravitate to that. And it's more of a personal connection with them. And I think that's important with the listener and the band. So that's basically what Seven Reasons is about. It's about relationships and how relationships can go bad. And when the video comes out, it'll really make more sense and kind of connect the song and the video together. When we originally wrote the song, it was an all acoustic song, uh, which is basically an acoustic guitar and vocals. Uh, my guitar player, Steve Bell, and I put this song together a while back, and it was just strictly acoustic, kind of put it away. Um, didn't really work on it for a while, and then we brought it back and said, wow, we really have some good stuff here, a really strong hook, and really good parts, and we, you know, we need to work on this more. I think we got a strong song here. So basically what we did is we brought in the whole band and we figured we needed to take it to the next level. So we wanted it to be a full electric song and we thought that it would really bring it to life. So that's what we ended up doing. We recorded it last year and the song made our new CD, which came out in September, the end of September. And basically, as the album went out, on iTunes and different uh, social uh, medias, we were getting some great feedback from the uh, album and the song that always seemed to be coming back as they really enjoyed was Seven Reasons. So we kind of knew we had something there. So we figured we need to kind of roll with this and see where we can take this. So in the beginning of January, we decided to record another song and it was a completely different song and we wanted to kind of go outside the box and not use the same techniques as we did before and maybe bring outside players in to kind of expand the sound. So that's what we did. We ended up getting Ted Nugent's drummer, Jason Hartless, who's based in um, Detroit. And we had him play on this new song. Well, his sound engineer, who was working with him at the time, is uh, Chuck Alkazian. He's worked with bands such as Soundgarden and Volbeat and Eminem. And he was the engineer, and he said, wow, I really like your band. I think you got a really good sound. If you're looking for someone to mix it, I'd love to do it. So we ended up taking him. He started mixing the song, and it came out great. So we were really happy about that. And we ended up needing somebody to take control of several reasons. You know, we had the song, we had the original mix of it, and we wanted to take it to the next level. So we thought Chuck would be the guy. So he took it on. We took parts out, removed things, um, shortened the song a little bit, and it really came to life. And working with Chuck, you know, it's really important to have a good combination of uh, chemistry between the band and a producer. You know, you throw ideas back and forth from each other, and it really made the song strong. So really excited. The uh, single will be out March 20th and it'll be on iTunes and Spotify. And hope people get out there and take a listen to it. Uh, we're really proud of what it became and uh, hopefully you guys will too. Thank you.